everybody, this is Praxis, and it's cold outside today. It's uh, just a little bit above freezing, which might beg the question, why am I wearing shorts? It's just because it's supposed to be summer, so I'm committed to the attire at this point. Uh, what I've been doing today is not working on that structure over there. As you can see, yesterday I got the roof finished, I got a tarp on top of it, and now it is uh, impervious to rain and snow, somewhat. Uh, the corner, uh, I'm not, sorry, not the corners, the uh, ends, the triangular ends still need to be filled in with some boards. I was kind of hoping to do that today, but I just don't like working outside with my fingers when it's cold because it's just really uncomfortable. It's kind of uncomfortable anyway wearing the shorts, but I'm doing other things. When I first got here today, I did some indoor work, uh, some of that putty work on the floors, which I've been saving for days that were uncomfortable, and I finished that up. So then I figured, well, what else can I do? Um, Again, I didn't want to work on that because uh, you know I don't want to be taking the tarp off to work on it because there's you know snow coming down and we could get rain a little bit later, and it's really really windy so I can't work on the foam on the walls because you know the foam is like a giant kite so that wouldn't have worked so great. So I figured I'd do this. I'm working on the root cellar door. Uh, it had a lot of uh, pretty big uh, gaps between the boards because uh, I put them on wet, then they dried, and now there's little gaps in between them. That's kind of normal. It was what happened with the floorboards inside, and it's what happened with the, the boards on this as well. Uh, so I'm uh, insulating the door. Uh, I was going to insulate the door anyway, but this will uh, also act as a, uh, you know, a barrier so the air is not just blowing right through the cracks. Oh, and the sun's coming back out. It's been very variable today, although cold the entire time, but like snow, then sun, and, you know, everything. Um, so I'm using this material. This is uh, some packing material that came with uh, some solar panels that I uh, installed back at the last homestead. Uh, I gave it life as a pad underneath a uh, kind of uh, uh, toy play map. It was like roads uh, on like carpet that River played with a bunch. By the way, this is a, this is a bounce card. See how you, it like throws light on my face? That's what we do in the movie industry. You get like a big white card and it just throws light into the shadow side. Um, it, it has all sorts of different purposes. Bounce card, uh, pad underneath my boys, uh, you know, play mat, and now it's getting cut up and, uh, and put onto here. I'm doing two layers of it so that I can stagger the joints uh, between them and then taping off the joints just with duct tape. I don't know how long the duct tape is going to last, but it's something that's easy to throw up for now. I think ultimately what I'd like to do later on is to just put a maybe a board right over the whole thing. So just a piece of, uh, you know, thin piece of plywood or something like that just to kind of contain everything but for now I'm getting these guys up there and it's a great day to have this door open because it's been warm lately and I didn't want to let the cold out but now it's actually warmer inside it's like 44 degrees inside uh, so I'm, I'm actually letting some cold in while I work so that's what I'm doing today tomorrow's supposed to be 20 degrees warmer than today so I think I'm gonna be back on that structure tomorrow but for today I'm just trying to uh, you know do what I can and uh, maintain feeling in my fingers that's it Thanks for watching.